Hey, what's going on guys? It's Saturday, so you know what that means. I have a Search and Destroy Moab here. Um, this is an ACR Thermal Silenced. Um, I was just fooling around. This is the game directly after the one that I got the 36 and one with the FMG Akimbos. And uh, basically, this was my first try. I was like, dude, I got that last one. Why not go for another one right now? And uh, my team was like, sure, we'll give it a try. And uh, it worked out pretty well, and I actually had not used a thermal sight in this game before this, uh, but after using it, it's a pretty it's a pretty good weapon. And uh, this is on Sea Town. I've actually gotten one other Moab on Sea Town before. Um, it's a pretty good map for it. Basically, when you're using a thermal sight, what you want to do is you want to you want almost feather to the trigger like burst fire. That's the main thing. You want to burst fire the trigger, and uh, it'll give you less recoil. Uh, the second thing is it's actually very good long range and. It will have more recoil than the other sites, that's for sure, but it is quite good from long range. And uh, I also equipped the silencer so I could run around the map without being noticed, seen, yada, yada, yada. Um, <laughs> I think I'm going to post a Search and Destroy Moab once every Saturday, so you can always look for those, and they'll never be the same gun or gameplay. And I'm going to try to change up the maps just as, just as frequently. Um... <laughs> But yeah, this is, a, this is a search mob with the ACR thermal. Lots of people can't even get Moabs in regular games with thermal thermal weapons. <laughs> so that's why I thought this one was so special. And I uh, <laughs> hope you guys will see the same thing as you watch this. Um, basically, I just ran from spot to spot. And uh, it really worked out. Because if you sit still, you're going to get ganged up on, I guess. And uh, I made sure I moved around the map to different spots so that they wouldn't be able to find me and all run at me with FMG akimbos and <laughs> kick my ass. So basically, ah oh guys, um I just want to I just want to say that this is one of the only things I enjoy about Mario 3 anymore cuz there's no bullshit in this. I just get to play out the game as if I'm the last one left. I don't have to worry about my teammates lag compensation. <laughs> well, I still have to worry about that, but with these search mobs in search there's so little action going on, the lag compensation is not as bad as as most uh, respawn games and search games, since there's not as much action going on, so that's one of the better things. Um, but I'm actually using G18 Akimbo's in this game, and uh, I never actually, I never actually get a kill with them on my Mo on my Moab streak. Um, so, so I actually got 24 straight kills with just my, just my gun and C4. So I, I don't know, guys. I hope I hope you really do like that. And this video was actually 14 minutes before I went and edited it. So. <laughs> I had to edit up. I had to like edit it up like half the half the time. So I hope you guys really do appreciate this. I'm just tired from editing that whole entire amount. Um, basically on Sea Town, you saw my main rush routes. I like to go up the ladder on that one side and then make my way towards there. And on this side, right there, that's a beautiful C4 spot for this map. Um, it works almost every single time. There, 50% of the time there'll be a guy there, and uh, you can just pick him off each time. Uh. A few of these were some pretty close calls, but luckily I had the silencer on, so they couldn't pick me up. And uh, as you see here, I run from this spot over here to this spot, and then after that, this is a really important part of the gameplay that I wanted to stress. I see that there's two guys up there on the mini map, and instead of climbing up this ladder right here, like I really, really wanted to, I wait because I'm sure if I climb up that ladder, I'll get killed and they'll be waiting for me. And you know all that, you know how all that works sometimes. So I wait back, pick off that guy, see the other guy running away. And uh, you don't in this game you don't want to engage two people at one time because you're just gonna you're just gonna get shit on. I mean, either from the lag or from the fact that the guns aren't powerful enough or the fact that I don't know it's just so easy to kill someone. I guess you never want to take two people on at once. It's better to take one on, get cover, and then get the other one. So that's what I always try to do, and uh, that's a way to survive and live longer through your gunfights. So basically right here, um, last one alive, 1v1 situation, not by A, any plants B here. So whenever they plant the bomb, you want to make sure you cut off their routes, because there were two routes there, and I cut off that one, and got lucky. Uh, so this is going to be the round that I got my Moab, actually. And uh, it's 2-2 right now, and actually, so <laughs> C4, it's the best, guys. Get on that, get on that and use that shit. It's really, really good. Um, all right. Another thing I wanted to say real quick, um, I have a few games of Mario Fair 3 saved up, and I was kind of curious, I'm not really, oh, Skype, I'm not really enjoying playing it as much as I should be, and you saw that in my video yesterday, and wow, I don't know how he got back there, I was scared of shit, 
And you will get a few hit markers with it sometimes, which is kind of frustrating, but nevertheless, it's still a very good gun. And what I was saying is, I was playing Mafia 3 yesterday, and I wasn't having that much fun. You know, it's kind of a, with this, the new friendly nature of it is just, it just kills me. I don't, <laughs> I don't really enjoy it as much as I should. And uh, I think that could show in some of my commentary gameplay. Oh, there I got the Moab, 24 kill streak with the ACR, and then I pick them off with the G18 akimbos, which are very good for uh, machine pistols. You guys should use them if you don't want to use a Type 95 or Scorpion or MP9s. Um, so there I got the Moab, and I don't really want to play Modern Warfare 3 as much. I I play COD 4 and I play Modern Warfare 2, and even some <laughs> even some War at War if it's not hacked. I haven't even tried Black Ops yet. That might be an option. But I, I just am not enjoying this game as much, and I want to know if you guys can see that because it really, I made a channel so that I could, so that I could, you know, enjoy Call of Duty. I wanted to post good gameplays, and it seems that more and more the only Call of Duty gameplay I'm enjoying posting is the Search Moabs. So I will continue to post these on Saturdays, but I want to kind of switch the gameplay up on my channel, um, and I wanted to know what you guys, what you guys take on that was. Are you guys all for that? Do you guys not want to see that? Because I'll just post less if that's the case. Because I don't know, I don't like to do things that I don't enjoy. Alright, so right now I'm on a 28 kill streak, and you see the nerves just by how much I flick the scoreboard up and down. And uh, I'm like, wow, maybe I can go make this go another round and get a shit ton more kills. And uh, so I was like, guys, make sure, <laughs> if I die, do not win the game. <laughs> and sure enough, panic lunged like a boss with a Type 95. And here you see my teammate, alright, this is such bullshit, laying on the ground in final stand with a riot shield. And, oh my god, it just makes me sick just watching this now. He clutches it, and uh, he said his speakers weren't working or some shit like that. I don't know, it's fucking bullshit. Regardless, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like and favorite the video. Um, it really took a long time for me to make, and I thought it was a pretty good gameplay. Alright, let's see if we can get 500 likes and uh, a bunch of comments. Alright, thanks guys. I'll talk to you later. Peace.